All right, here's a follow up on the repair that I did. Um, I went back to the the video where the other gentleman had showed me how to repair uh, this piece here. Uh, so you know what I did notice is that he was complaining that there was a a white kind of like a compound or a white something. He thought it was actually burned material from from this right here from the rectifier. Uh, but another gentleman had said, you know what, this actually looks like thermal compound. I don't think it's from anything that's resulting any any like a byproduct of uh the item being burnt or melting in the process. So after I replaced it, I was looking at my grass and I didn't get like that nice gorgeous result, you know. I was kind of disappointed. Um so after reading, you know, about the the compound thing, I looked at mine and it, it does not have anything on here and I thought well, if this is the heat sink and there is nothing holding it to it, how is it supposed to cool down? How is this rectifier supposed to cool down if it only touches the heat sink but there's nothing to compound, nothing to to like bond it with. So, so I've done, you know, work on my own computers and in replacing the the CPUs, you need a good thermal compound in order to keep the chips cool. I use Arctic Silver 5 on my computers, so guess what I used here? Yeah. So I dropped in some Arctic Silver 5, you know, put some dots on the bottom, got a razor, spread it out with a razor blade, put it on there, and then I had some leftover heat sinks. So what I did was, I, <laughs> as you can see, I attached them to the back of it or to the side. I just couldn't fit anymore on this side or this side. They wouldn't fit. These are too, they're a little bit too too big, too tall. And so, I mean, I, sure, I could shave them and then add them on the side, but you know what? That should be sufficient. And I noticed, I mean, maybe it's placebo, but I noticed that I got better performance with this. So, if you have a Greenworks mower and you're having this kind of issue with this, with this one, this is the, I believe, what is it, 20 inch model. Um, yeah, this is the 20 inch 12 amp model. So, there you have it guys. Enjoy, have fun, tinkering with these toys. It was pretty awesome just running like this without a top on the <laughs> on my front lawn. I think I'll keep it this way. I don't plan on putting that cover on top of it. It looks pretty rad like this. Alright, take it easy.